Hi, I'm August Bryce with TechWellness.com, where we talk about how to live healthier and safer in our wireless world. Part of our wireless world is electromagnetic fields, or EMF, EMF radiation. I'm sure you've heard about it now, especially since you're wanting to watch this video where we're going to talk about a wireless baby monitor, and that's the La Rev or La Reve. EMF can be very, very serious. Our own national toxicology program did a long five-year study, spent millions and millions of dollars, and found out that there was a link between EMF radiation exposure and heart tumors and cancers. So we also have tons of different research studies on techwellness.com linking to various health effects from EMF exposure. Now, most of these studies, or a lot of the studies, are done on rats and mice as they should be. We're not going to study babies and children being exposed to EMF. That would be horrible. So that's what we have to work with. We do know from a very large Kaiser Permanente study that women who were pregnant, who were exposed to more EMF, had more likelihood of miscarriages. We also know from a study done out of Yale University that mice that were exposed to EMF while they were pregnant had babies that displayed more ADHD symptoms. So, you know, it's better safe than sorry, right? Better not to be exposed to it, especially not to expose our children to it if we don't have to. So we've set up this low EMF environment with this fabric. This is called Swiss Daylight and our neighbors do have a smart meter and they do have Wi-Fi and it helps lessen our exposure. And you can see the background level of radiation in this room is pretty low. It's going between slight and moderate. And on this meter, if we can get to 10, we're in a super, super safe, low EMF environment for sleeping. And so you can see we're bouncing at that peak level between, well, four and 25. But now watch when we look at this low EMF, it's called La Reve. So right now I've turned it on and now what I'm going to do next, okay, look, this is an immense amount of radiation. This is the parent unit. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it into the power save mode. So I'll press this, Let's see what's going to happen here. Come on, power save. Okay, so it's telling me that in 30 seconds, we're going to go into power save and that's going to lower the EMF radiation at the baby monitor where you can see Rachel's inside. She's measuring the levels there and it will also lower it here and then it will only be voice activated. So let's give it probably 15 seconds more and we'll watch those levels go down. Ah, I feel better. <laughs> okay, so we got to a high of 157. So I'm gonna reset. And now Rachel will activate the monitor. Okay, Rachel, go ahead. It's set at a high sensitivity level, so it should come on pretty quickly. There we go. She's activated with her voice. And now once again, the parent unit will have high EMF. And obviously it's high, it's blinking extreme. So this is a high level exposure. The further you can be away from the parent unit, the better. As you can see, even as we Okay, let's watch this. I'll, do, I'll reset it as we get further and further away. Still pretty high, even with this low EMF, low RF radiation. Okay, and now it's gone into the safe mode again. So the idea is you only are exposed to EMF radiation when there's a sound from your baby. And you can set that sensitivity level to high, medium, or low. It's up to you. And now we're gonna see what the levels are that the baby is exposed to. So the camera's 10 feet away from where the baby would be. See that little bear? The meter is detecting the EMF that a baby would be exposed to. The camera's on and sending pictures and sound to the parent unit. The meter LED lights represent slight to extreme readings as designated by the Institute of Building Biology. So the red LED light means any reading over 1,000 microwatts per square meter. We notice that when the LAREV is in standby mode, this is good, the wireless EMF readings are much lower. In fact, they're on the lower end of the moderate zone, usually from 36 to 50, with a bounce occasionally up to 60. I'm gonna activate the baby monitor. I'm gonna start crying like I'm a baby. I'm activating the monitor. 
Now it's interesting. We notice that after the Larev is activated, that camera stays on and sends video and audio to the parent unit for as long as up to one minute and 45 seconds. Not much fluctuation. So now I've brought the La Reve camera into the low EMF environment, and we've done this with other wireless cameras as well. So you wanna check out uh, the Hello Baby and the Bed Care videos. These, those demonstrations will show you different levels. And I can tell you, I'm pretty impressed with this one so far. However, it's still high radiation. I would prefer to have no baby monitor at all if I was exposing my baby to even this much radiation. And as you can see right now, there's nothing because it's only activated just like the other units when the parent unit is on. So we'll turn the parent unit on and we'll see what happens in here. And yes, we're getting higher peak levels. They are going to extreme as it connects. Uh, maybe when I stop speaking, when it goes into eco mode, it will be much lower, but I do want to show you what the levels are when we get six feet away. We were six feet away when we were in the other room, but now this is about, we're going to see some cameras here and we're six feet away and I'll reset so that you can get a good idea. Well, we're still at an extreme level. So oh, maybe we go down between high and extreme, but still it just shows you that these are very powerful wireless machines. So really think a lot about this decision that you're making. And like I say, distance is your friend when it comes to EMF. So the further that any of us can be away from the source, and the source is always where the antenna is, the better off we'll be. If you want to know more about EMF or just living well in our digital world, please visit techwellness.com and you can like and subscribe and see more of these. Be well.